So looking back, what experiences or what story do you remember the most about the philosophy around the customer getting a little bit more than they paid for? Basically a, a, a pragmatic um, and deliberate decision to say, okay, the customer is our boss. He should get a little more than he thought he paid for and then behave accordingly. And the senior manager team of the company was always totally dedicated to that proposition. The honest dealings with customers was obviously of a given. The company is always engaged in the highest level of ethics and that persists through today. I'm, I'm pleased to see that. So basically, customers are boss. It was uh, something that everybody bought into. Every company exists for only one reason, and that's to serve its customers. You gotta do a lot of other things to, to sustain yourself, but that, without that, you're nowhere. As we celebrate Fluke's 75th anniversary, what do you hope that we remember and continue to take forward? Obviously, the, uh, the technology changes, uh, the products will change, and the functionality will change. But the, this attitude towards the customer and product quality and prompt service and competitive prices and all the other uh, details that go into winning in, in the marketplace, that will never change. And I presume that that will go on in the unforeseeable future. I really appreciate the extent to which Danner and then Fortif has maintained the um, elements of the culture that are they're once very subtle they're, and they're not at all tangible in one respect. So you can be really the best you are at what, what you do for the customer. Mm -hmm.